In today's handoff, a story you can file under the heading Better Late Than Never. The Northern Star, Northern Illinois University student newspaper just issued an apology and a retraction for publishing a report that music legend Paul McCartney was dead all the way back in September of 1969, 54 years ago. There was a conspiracy theory back then that the Beatle had died in a car accident in 1966 and it was replaced by a very convincing look-alike, the band, it was said back then, allegedly hid messages about Paul's death in their records, which could be deciphered by playing them backwards or reading into some cryptic lyrics. It was, of course, a bunch of nonsense. The Northern Star published all the rumors in a column that is still cited by conspiracy theorists to this day. It turns out not only was the column full of bad information, it was plagiarized. <laughs> the current editorial staff wrote an apology to Sir Paul, writing, we truly apologize for our contribution to supporting an unfound conspiracy theory. Wow. And good for them. All and, these years later. Right. All these years later. And think about all the foolishness on social oh. media right now. Imagine. Which is why even now you still have to clear it up, That's even right. decades later.